Hi students, welcome to Justin NCRT Solutions. In this video, we are going to see 600 Maths Chapter 3 Exercise 3.3 First Question. They have given one tabular column. In this, we are going to find whether the number is divisible by 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11. Then they have given the numbers. By using the divisibility rules, we are going to find whether it is true, or yes or no. First, 128 they have given everything now we are going to find it from 990 first we will find all the one by two then three like that we will go one by one the first one 990 according to the divisibility rule if the last digit is divisible that 0 2 4 6 8 we can divide the number so here last one's place is 0 therefore this number is divisible by 2 yes next here one's place is 6 so 6 is divisible by 2 therefore the entire number is divisible by 2 Next here 5 is there, 5 is not divisible by 2, so no. And next 6, 1's place is 6, so that is divisible by 2, we have written yes. And here 1's place is 0, so that number is divisible by 2, yes. And here 4, 4 is divisible by 2, so yes. Next here 6 is there, 6 is divisible by 2, so yes. And here 0, 1's place is 0, this 0 is divisible by when we are taking that last one's place is 0 means that entire number is divisible by 2. So, yes. Next here 9 is there. 9 is not divisible by 2. Therefore, no. Next we are going to check it for 3. Divisibility by 3. First number. The divisibility rule is sum of its digit is divisible by 3 means that number is divisible by 3. Now we are going to check it. 9 plus 9 is equal to 18 that 18 is divisible by 3 therefore this number is divisible by 3 next number we can add it 6 plus 8 14 14 plus 5 19 19 plus 1 20 this 20 is not divisible by 3 so therefore this number is not divisible by 3 no and next we will check it. 5 plus 7, 12, 12 plus 2, 14. 14 is, 14 is not divisible by 3. Therefore, this number is not divisible by 3. Again, I am repeating. If sum of its, its digit is divisible by 3, then that number is divisible by 3. Otherwise, it is not divisible by 3. So, now we are going to check it. 6 plus 8, 14, 14 plus 6, 20, 20 plus 6, 26. 26 is not divisible by 3. Therefore, the, this number is not divisible by 3. Next, we are going to check it. 2 plus 1, 3. 3 plus 9, 12. 12 plus 3, 15. 15 plus 6, 21. 21 is divisible by 3. Therefore, this number is divisible by 3. 7, 3 is 21. So, that number is divisible by 3. Next, we are going to check it. 4 plus 1, 5. 5 plus 7, 12. 12 plus 9, 21, 21 plus 2, 23, 23 plus 4, 27, 27 is divisible by 3 because 9 threes are 27. So, this answer, this number is divisible by 3. Next number, 6 plus 5, 11, 11 plus 8, 19, 19 plus 2, 21, 21 is divisible by 3, therefore the number is divisible by 3. Next, we are going to add it 6 plus 3, 9. 9 is divisible by 3. So, this number is divisible by 3. Yes. Next, 9 plus 3, 12. 12 plus 8, 20. 20 plus 6, 26. 26 plus 10, 30. 30 is divisible by 3. So, the given number is divisible by 3. So, we have completed divisibility rules for 2 and 3. Now, we are going to find it for next, divisible by 4. If last two digits are divisible by 4, that entire number is divisible by 4. So, now we are going to check it. Last two digits, 90. In 90, how many 4s are there? We have, when we are dividing by 90, two 4s are 8, remaining 1, 10. Two 4s are 8, remaining 2. So, this is not divisible by 4. Next, two digits, 86. 86 also here, two fours are 8. Then here only one four, remaining two is coming. So, this is also not divisible by 4. And next here, 75. 
75 is exactly not divisible by 4. So, this is also no. Next, 86. Already we saw that 86. So, 86 is not divisible by 4. Next, 10. 10 is not divisible by 4 because remaining 2 will come. So, this is also no. And 14. 14 is not divisible by 4. So, this number is not divisible by 4. And next, 56. 56 is possible. We will check it. 1, 4 is 4. Remaining 1, 16. 4, 4 are 16. So, this number is divisible by 4. This number is divisible by 4. Next, last two digits, 60. We will check it. 1, 4 is 4. Remaining 2. So, 20. 5, 4 are 20. So, 60 is divisible by 4. Therefore, this entire number is divisible by 4. Next, last two digits, 39. Not at all possible. So, we cannot divide this 39 by 4. So, this number is not divisible by 4. Now, we are going to check it for divisibility rule for 5. According to the divisibility rule 5, if 1's place is 0 or 5, either 0 or 5 means that number is divisible by 5. Now, we are going to check it. 0 is there. So, this number is divisible by 5. Yes. And next here, 1's place 6. 6 is not divisible by 5, so no. Next here, 5 is there, yes. 1's place 6, not possible, so no. 1's place is 0, yes. That number is divisible by 5. 4 is not divisible by 5, so no. 1's place 6, not divisible by 4, no. 0, there is possibilities, we can divide it by 5. Next, 9, 9 is not divisible by 5 so no next divisible by 6 divisible by 6 already we saw that if a number is divisible by both 2 and 3 if a number is divisible by both 2 and 3 that number is divisible by 6 so now we are going to find by using these two yes no so no if both also x yes if you return 2 and 3 yes yes that number is divisible by 6 here 990 is yes, yes, both also yes. So, here also that number is divisible by yes. But here 2 is divisible but by 3 we cannot divide. So, this is no. And here no, no, both also no. So, that number is not divisible by 6 also. Here 1 yes, 1 no. So, we cannot divide it. And next yes, yes, both also yes. Okay, we can divide it by 2 also. We can divide it by 3 also. Therefore, yes. Next here also, 2 also, 3 also, therefore 6 also will divide the number. And here, this, are, this number also divisible by 2 and 3, therefore this answer is divisible by 6. Next here also, 2 and 3 is dividing, so that answer is divisible by 6. And here 1 no, 1 yes, we cannot divide this number by 6. So, we found that divisibility by 6. Now, divisibility by 8, if sum of uh, no, for this, if last three digits are divisible by 8, that number is divisible by 8. If last three digits are divisible by 8, that number is divisible by 8. We will check it. 990. We will check it. Last three digits. <coughs> Here, 180 is there. Remaining 1, 19. 2 8s are 16. Remaining 3, 30. 30 is not divisible by 8. So, no. And next number, last 3 digits, 586. 5 is there. In 58, we have 6, 9, 6 nines are 54. 6 nines are 54. Remaining 4 in 46, we cannot divide. Sorry, sorry, here. 58 is there. We have to divide it by 8. Seven eights are 56, remaining to 26. 26 is not divisible by 8. So, this is also no. And next number, 275. 275, we will check it by 8. 2 eights are 
3 8s are 24. Remaining 3 is 35. 35 is not divisible by 8. Therefore, this number no. And next, 686. Divided by 8. In 68, Eight eights are sixty-four. Eight eights are sixty-four, remaining four forty-six. Forty-six is not divisible by eight, therefore this number is also not divisible by eight. Next number two hundred and ten. Two hundred and ten. Two eights are sixteen. Remaining five. Fifty is not divisible by eight. So this number is not divisible by Eight. And next, 714 divisible by 8. <coughs> 8 eights are 64, remaining 7, 74. 9 eights are 72, remaining 2. So, this number is also not divisible by 8. And next number. 856 we will check it by 8 in 8 only 1 8 is there remaining this 5 this 5 is not divisible by 8 so we added 0 now 6 in 8 in 56 how many 8's are there 7 8s are 56. 7 8s are 56. So, this number is divisible by 8. This number is divisible by 8. And next number, last 3 digits, 60 is coming. If 60 is coming, that number is not divisible by 8. Because one number is 0, last 2 digits only 60. 60 is not divisible by 8, therefore no. And next number, 839 last three, uh, three digits 839 is not possible to divide it because 839 if you are dividing by 8 180 is 8 remaining 0 so we have taken this 3 we cannot divide so we added 0 next 9 39 is coming so we cannot divide so when we are dividing by 8 only this uh, 2856 only possible we can divide it remaining we cannot divide. Next, we are going to check it for divisible by 9. Divisibility of 9. <coughs> divisibility by 9. The rules for divisibility of 9. If sum of its digit is divisible by 9, that number is divisible by 9. According to the rules, if sum of its digit is divisible by 9, that number is divisible by 9. Now we are going to check it. 9 plus 9, 18. That 18 is divisible by 9. Therefore, this number is divisible by 9. Yes. Next number, 6 plus 8, 14. 14 plus 5, 19. 19 plus 1, 20. 20 is not divisible by 3. Therefore, no. Next, 5 plus 2 sorry 5 plus 7 12 12 plus 2 14 14 is not divisible by 9 therefore no and next number 6 plus 8 14 14 plus 6 20 20 plus 6 26 is not divisible by 9 therefore no we cannot divide it by 9 and now this number 1 10 12 15 21. 21 is not divisible by 9, therefore no. And here 5, 12, 21, 23, 27. 27 is divisible by 9, therefore that number is divisible by 9. Yes. Next, 11, 19, 21. 21 is not divisible by 9, therefore the number is not divisible by 9. Next number, 6 plus 3, 9. 9 is divisible by 9, therefore, yes, we can divide it by 9. Next number, 12, 20, 26, 30. 30 is not divisible by 9, therefore, no, that number also not divisible by 
10 sorry divisible by 9 so we have completed up to divisibility 9 now we are going to check it for divisibility rules for 10 according to the divisibility rules 10 if the ones place is ending with 0 that number is divisible by 10 now we are going to check it here ending with 0 so that number is divisible by 10 next number 6 we cannot divide so no ones place is 5 we cannot divide no next 6 6 is not divisible so no and here ones place 0 so we can divide it by 10 yes and here 4 we cannot divide no and here 6 we cannot divide no and here ones place is 0 we can divide it so yes and last number ending with 9 we cannot divide it so no and now we are going to check it for 11 according to the divisibility rules for 11 if sum of its odd digits and sum of its even digits then we have to find the difference if difference of sum of its odd digits and even digits is divisible by 11 that number is divisible by 11 now we are going to check it odd digits 0 sum of its odd digits 0 plus 9 is equal to 9 and even digit 9 9 minus 9 is equal to 0 if sum of its odd digits and even digits is either 0 or divisible by 11 that number is divisible by 11 and here we are getting 0 therefore this number is divisible by 11 and next <coughs> 275 we first we have to add the odd digits 5 plus 2 is equal to 7 and even digit 7 minus 7 is equal to 0 so if we are getting 0 so this number also divisible by 11 and next sum of odd digits 6 plus 6 12 and even digit 8 plus 6 14 difference between these two is equal to 2 14 minus 12 difference between these two is 2 so this is not divisible by 11 therefore this number is not divisible by 11 next number odd digits 0 2 3 2 plus 3 5 now we are going to add even digits 1 plus 9 10 10 plus 6 16 16 minus 5 is equal to 11 so 11 is divisible by 11 therefore this number is divisible by 11 sorry we missed one sum this sum we missed it we will solve it now this is no only we missed it now we will check it <coughs> next number odd digits 4 7 2 4 plus 7 11 11 plus 2 13 and here even digits 1 plus 9 10 10 plus 4 14 minus 13 is equal to 1 this is not divisible by 11 therefore this number is not divisible by 11 and next this sum odd digits is equal to 6 plus 8 is equal to 14 now we are going to add even digits 5 plus 2 7 difference is 7 this number is not divisible by 11 therefore this answer is not divisible by 11 and next number sum of its odd digits is equal to 0 plus 0 0 even digits 6 plus 3 is equal to 9 9 minus 0 is equal to 9 this this number is not divisible by 11 therefore this answer is not this number is not divisible by 11 and next last number sum of its odd digits 9 8 0 9 plus 8 17 17 plus 0 17 only next number even digits 3 plus 6 9 9 plus 3 12 17 minus 12 is equal to 5 this 5 is not divisible by 11 therefore that number is not divisible by 11 okay that's all students we have written everything with all that proofs but still if you have any doubts we have added that divisibility rules 
in the previous videos kindly refer that videos kindly go through that solve it more sums then you can get uh, clear your doubts and those are all already subscribe our channel subscribe share this video to your friends and give your comments in the comments box